You know, my friends, I happen to, well, I don't know, but I'm fairly confident that the elements of the drive-by media are monitoring today's show. Would you think that's a pretty good bet? Of course, they're looking for evidence that I support this cockamamie conspiracy theory. So let me feed the beast. Do you remember that clandestine meeting that we wouldn't know about were it not for a local Phoenix TV info person between Bill Clinton and Loretta Lynch on her airplane on the tarmac in Phoenix? Clinton landed there. We're told that somebody told Bill Clinton that Loretta was down there, that she had just landed. And Clinton, hey, <laughs> Loretta's here. You know, she owes me a lot. I put her on the Eastern District. Let's get, let's get this taxi over there. I got to talk to Loretta. So they went in there and they talked about their grandkids, of which she doesn't have any. A week later, the second FISA warrant was granted. <laughs> what if Bill Clinton asked for the FISA warrant? Hey, I just saw feeding the beast here. Just having a little fun with the media. You know elements of the drive bars are listening. What if, you know, everybody's wondering what, what did Clinton want to talk to her about? And everybody assumes it was to tell her to go easy on Hillary and to dump that investigation and tell Tommy to get out there, Comey to get out there and pound sand or whatever. So she recuses herself. Well, she didn't. She didn't. She removed her, but she didn't recuse. She, she didn't say she could take herself out. She just turned it over to Comey or whatever. But it was just a week later that the second FISA request was made to surveil the Trump associates on, on uh, whatever. No, I don't know anything. And also about Loretta Lynch. Folks, get that she was the former attorney general. Are you ready for this? Loretta Lynch made a video... And in this video, she is making a plea to leftist protesters to keep it up. She actually asks for more blood and death on the streets. This video that was posted on the Facebook page of Senate Democrats as words of inspiration. The video is less than a minute long. It begins by stating that people are experiencing great fear and uncertainty with the unstated implications because of Trump and his takeover of the White House. She says that our rights are being assailed, our rights are being trampled on, and our rights are even being rolled back. I know this is a time of great fear and uncertainty for so many people. I know it's a time of concern. See, our rights being assailed, being trampled on, and even being rolled back. I know it's difficult, but I remind you this has never been easy. We have always had to work to move this country forward to achieve the great deals, ideals of our founding fathers. So, former attorney general is encouraging all of this rioting. Now, there's another reason the left is mad. The ratings for that new gay TV show, Up From Rising or Rising From Up, bombed. I mean bombed. I, had, I think they had an audience smaller than the transgender population watching that show. It's nothing. Loretta Lynch ended this video by saying so that people have banded together, ordinary people. They've marched, they've bled, and yes, some of them died. It's hard. Everything good is. We've done it before. We can do it again. So march, bleed, die. Loretta Lynch in a video. Back in a second.